Hey guys, my name is Seniac and welcome back to another episode of Sim Airport where guys, last episode we started, started to kind of build up all the stuff in the terminal right now. We got our little cafe area up which I kind of forgot to add in the uh, kitchen storage. Got it in guys, don't worry. Uh, our second chef is now working in here so they're both going to be cooking up a storm. Got all the restrooms in. Decorated the kind of inside of the terminals and we got the upstairs sorted as well to the point where we're now ready guys We are now ready to start building and adding in more gates and then start having more fun There's a lot I need to do gonna change the runway slightly add in a few more entrances and exits So we can get more planes landing and taking off all at the same time and um yeah, this one's going to be interesting. Now, I've got no money right now, but that is for a good reason. I finally paid off that big boy loan that I had. So if I really want to, I could get some more money, but we'll kind of keep it like that for just just, just, just the time being. we we'll see where we can go with this. But guys, if you are enjoying this episode and this series, then please make sure you smash that like button down below. If you're new around here, make sure you do subscribe so you're notified when the next episode does come out. But we're still having that quiet period. We, we need those early morning flights. Now, for the longest time, I've kind of forgotten about the early morning flights. And we need to figure out how do we get them. So is it airport efficiency? I don't think it's this. Is it airport services? Uh, yes, we need to complete uh, this one, believe it or not. So if I accept this grant right now, it gives us 45000 to do some stuff with. And we need to serve 10 planes with a functioning fuel system. Uh, negotiate and assign 10 offices to airlines as well. Ooh, there's a lot to get done now, isn't there? There is a lot to get done. Now, when I added it in this last time, it didn't go too well. So we'll try and build the fuel system. We'll get some more gates, get those peeps, and then hopefully we can have 24 hours a day planes landing left, right, and center. So I might have to, um, you know, call on the good old friend Google to help me out on this at some point. But I'll try and figure it out all over again right now. So a fuel depot receives jet fuel deliveries and distributes it into the pipeline. So this is something that kind of needs to be like out here basically. Where vehicles can come and they can drop the goods off and in. Now I think it was originally like round up here somewhere. But if I just for now place it here. Let it do its thing. Then we need the refueling station for the vehicle. So provide a fuel, provide your fuel trucks with access to the fuel, blah, 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 blah. Allows your fueling services to be offered on your network. So I could place this here, for example. Smack bang right there. Now, between that and our refuel, uh, de uh, fuel depot, I need some tanks. Now, we have the generic fuel tank, 90,000 litre capacity. The large one, which is 1.6 million. Is that right? And then this one. Oh, one's underground, one's not underground. I gotcha. But I could, like, can I legit place this here? It's way too big, right? Uh, too close to taxiway. I mean, the underground one. Where could that go? Is it, like, legit place it underground? Must be placed on floor minus two. See, that's getting a little bit too confusing now, isn't it? I think that is. So what I'll do... How much... Okay, it's a lot more expensive, isn't it? Man, these are so expensive, aren't they? So if I just place this here... So expensive! But it's something that we're going to need. Now, we're also going to need all of the fuel pipes, which we'll get in momentarily anyway. And hopefully we can figure out what we've got to do. So the day is now starting, which brings... All the peeps coming in. They're spending their monies. They're arriving. And before you know it, we're going to be mooling. No, we're not going to be millionaires again. But I'll I might have to get another loan, even though I just kind of briefly repaid off the last one. I might have to get another one. <clears throat> it's going to have the money coming through. Now, can we assign these to the aircraft? I'm not sure if you can unless you kind of get everything all completed. But I'll wait for everything to be built anyway. Before we jump on everything. But like I said, money's now coming in, which is good to see. So I also got a hire. <clears throat> uh, we'll get 10 people assigned. What was it again? Sorry, 10 what? 
uh, negotiate and assign 10 offices to airlines, which at the minute we have... Is it the sales rep? Is that what it is? I assume it is. Is it an admin sales rep? Yeah, so we've already got three. So if I add it up to 10, pay for them, I've got 10 peeps. I've just then got to assign them to uh, the airlines. So... Negotiate and assign 10 offices to airlines. I assume that's what I've got to do, right? I could be wrong. I could literally be so wrong right now. But uh, I've also got to figure out how do I do this again. So reps, one. Yeah, we've got one already assigned. Uh, yeah, like I said, I assume this is what we do. Select the rep, uh, assign... There we go. Easy jet. Select a rep. Assign. Negotiate. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Do I mean, upsell your contracts to airlines by offering facilities in exchange for higher fees. So large planes. In the AM. Cool. Oh, they want, like... This stuff. <laughs> um, right, maybe I need to build... Right. Oh, wait, it will hurt the communication. Right, okay, so... Non-negotiable, non-negotiable offices, negotiable small, non-negotiable stores, cafes, conference rooms... <clears throat> uh, cafe share profit? No. No, you don't even share profits right now. Minimum load. Breach penalty. Roadway fees. Um, right, should we send an offer? Then we'll get back to you. Have accepted our offer. Okay. Right, does that count as one then? I assume that counts as one. Negotiate and assign 10 offices to airlines. Uh, maybe. Does it then change one of these to say, like, EasyJet office? Or is that not a thing? I don't think that's a thing. Let me just pause for a minute. Because now we've got these EasyJet aircraft wanting to land. So if I quickly just drop these down. Granted, not going to be able to fit in. And we've got one more I can't squeeze in. But I'll get you in in just a second, boys. I'll get you in in just a second. Let me go back down here. Oh my goodness me. I should have I should have waited for this stuff, shouldn't I? Why is there two? Two notifications. I don't know. Um, objects, large aircraft gate. I'm about to say, why is it not going in? I gotta flip it around. Right, bam. How much are they? They're forty thousand. Okay, we'll get the two in. And uh, let them do what they've gotta do. It's not gonna be until the next day anyway, so we can kind of like hold our horses on that. But the fuel's now in. Again, let's pause real quick. I, I, I've done too much stuff at once, and now I'm panicking. Now your boy's panicking. So, there, there. Right, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. I already got pipe working over there. I completely forgot about. Um, Right, it's got to get into over here, which I assume I can't go through there. But we're not going to have any other baggage coming in at the minute, are we? So if I bring this right down to here. Right across. There we go. We're looking at the placement really for there, aren't we? Fast forward. <clears throat> right, there's definitely a lot going on, isn't there? There definitely is a lot going on. Which in the taxiway, we're going to have to squeeze in there and there just kind of double it up on the bulkiness in case we ever have any more on the other side but we do need a few more runway exits and whatnot right a lot of stuff being placed in right now a lot of stuff so i can get you ready bam is that everyone at this point Why are you still red? 
Oh, we're missing some negotiated fees. I think it's the fuel, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm also going to need dead objects on the old ops. <clears throat> Let me pause. I need the... Is it, or is it in construction? Objects. Utilities? Where is these hangers? Um... Ah, medium hanger. What's this one? This is a large hanger, isn't it? Right, it's all in alphabetical order. There we go. So I'm going to place one here, one there. Get the fuel vehicles all in. A lot going down right now. There's a lot we need to get done. But hopefully they'll kill the game. They'll destroy it. They'll get it done for us. Actually, pause again because I also need to do the uh, the fuel stuff, don't I? Operations, fuel services. So, if is it not is it not ready to go yet? No, I need more stuff until we can activate it. I need those hangers built. I have twelve hours left to fix it. Oh my goodness, mate! We get there, guys. See pressure. I got pressure on my shoulders right now. I can't be dealing with this pressure. All right, got to get this hanger done. Oh, 92%. Come on. Come on with your 92% right now. Let us get let's get it going. All right, there we go. Done. Pause. So, we're going to assign vehicles then. We'll assign the fuel truck, fuel truck, fuel, fuel, fuel. Okay. While we're here anyway, we're going to quickly assign the gates. And I've got to change the names of these. Assign. All right, it's easy to go back and forth. So, okay, close that. So these are, you've got A, B, <clears throat> And these are all now going to be C. So C, well, it needs to be C1. You'll be C2. So that makes you C1. And then you're C3. Nice. Nice. We then need to operations. Here we go. We can now sort out the fuel in. So we'll do a... Track the market price, and we'll do slightly above. Should we do ten percent above the market price? Why not? Why not? Buy a one-time load of over half a million liters. Look how expensive that is. Buy fuel. So I assume that's now filled up, right? Or does it then get delivered? Okay, it's getting delivered right now. The capacity of it is all now going in. Okay. Pause. So what are these guys wanting then that I don't have technically in? I think it was easy jet, right? So miss oh a conference room. Can I renegotiate? No. They needed a conference room. Hmm. Can I build a conference room in twelve hours? What does a conference room consist of? Uh, these are vital communications. Right, let me kind of quickly like zone an area, just so I can see what it actually requires. Uh, being secured by one or more reception. Wait, what? Oh, this is too confusing. Do you know what, guys? We're gonna have to. It's my bad. I should have realised that I've kind of asked them to have a conference room. <coughs> so. Yeah. It's my bad. Right, play. We'll, 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 let, we'll let them lose the contract, okay? <coughs> we'll, let, we'll, we'll lose the contract. I don't mind. I don't mind too much. So, I need some more exits. Um, so, what if I... See, I can't flip it round. Is that good enough to say that's an exit? I don't quite know how that works. Or if I did one there. 
I need more space, don't I, guys? I just need more space in general. I spent a fortune. It would be nice to see if we can actually refuel some of the planes. Right, I'm willing to lose that EasyJet uh, contract <clears throat> for the sake of them being able to get everything else all set up. That's kind of what we're hoping for anyway. So I don't know if this is going to do anything for us. They're doing some maintenance right now. Do you know what? That's not... I, I, it has to go over here, doesn't it? What am I doing right now, guys? Right. Um, baggage claim must meet requirements. Wait, what? It's not accessible? What's happened now? What? Wait, what? What has happened? What has legit happened? That the baggage claim is no longer no longer. <clears throat> I'm confused. Oh, is it because I've done this finally? Okay, we'll dismantle it. There we go. It was the little walkway. They finally built it. That was really weird. That really was. Right, we're in tons of debt. I've spent a fortune. But hopefully we can now start refilling, refueling the vehicle, uh, airplanes. And that's what we're hoping for right now. So, to be honest with you, I don't think that's in the best position. That should have been over here. <clears throat> or at least there. To give it a much easier access to other places. But now we're going to have more planes coming in the morning than ever before. So we're going to see it. Oh, oh, oh. Is that a fueling vehicle? It is! Look at this! We're fueling! Your boy's fueling right now. Oh, where am I gone? There I am. Your boy is refueling right now. Extra pennies in our pockets. Not bad. Very good, if anything. Very, very good. I'm happy. So, yeah, I'm not sure that this is going to do anything for us. That additional bit. I need more space, don't I? I do need more space. Off they all go. So, let me zoom out and just kind of watch the overview of it. They're all staggered, so they, they all go at their own different times. Oh, okay, they do pull into there. <clears throat> okay, so I suppose it's handy a little bit for them, like, landing. But, like I said, we're not going to break any records. Uh, this one's delayed from the baggage load. Oh, okay, so we're going to need some more. Ooh. Yes, that is correct, because these guys don't have the baggage set up. Ah. Now, there's my next issue. So, utilities, the baggage depot, we're then going to have... If we rotate you and go there. I forgot about that. Which does mean then, obviously, assigning uh, baggage car. We'll assign two more baggage cars. <clears throat> which then means i got to build all this underground system. Hmm. So in reality, it should be pretty simple for us. It should be. Um, if I can flip this one to be a consumer, that one to be a producer, they'll run directly up to, to here. But it means, obviously, foundations. So if I do all of this, which is nearly a quarter of a million, just to get the conveyors running up. But then, everything's all rocking and rolling. So I can assign these quickly to these gates. So they're good to go once the uh, the aircraft is all done. <clears throat> is what I'm trying to say. Oh, planes land both directions. I didn't realise that. Has that always been a thing? Or is it all based on... I think it's based on where the wind's going, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. 
So how are we doing down below then? We're waiting for these foundations to finalize. And because you got the back and forth there, we're pretty much all set up for it. Oh my god, I've, I completely forgot all the other logistics we've got to get done when we're building all of this. Completely forgot about it, man. So foolish! And then we've got to uh, obviously dismantle you. Dismantle you. Um, conveyor. Right, that's coming straight down. And then that goes straight up. And it's done. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, he says. And then hopefully there'll be no more delayed flights. And those planes can skedaddle down here. So has it been 12 hours yet where these guys are fully like cutting all ties with us? I don't quite know. But have we done 10 planes for the grant? Yes. I just got to negotiate and assign 10 offices for the airlines. Right, okay. Right, we're 300 grand in debt, so the debt has dramatically decreased. It has dramatically decreased right now. So that's now all up and running, right? We won't find out till the next day anyway. Because there's no only the planes are scheduled in the morning. So let's get back on it and with um this negotiation style stuff. So um negotiate. Um uh, right, how do I cancel the current deal? Do I just wait for it to kind of disappear? We'll start a new one. We'll go with um, Ryanair. Is it Ryanair that we've got loads of planes of? Yeah, we case Ryanair and United Airlines. So United Airlines, let's speak to these guys right now. Um, we got a, we got a, a rep for them. Let's negotiate. And we'll go for large aircraft. We'll go for four new ones. And we'll go for these for the PM flights. Let's call them up. So, hot, hot. So, no share on you. No share. No share. Um, once what? Uh, prefer to pay a fixed daily rate. Oh, okay. Yeah, why not? All right, let's go. No first class lounge. No, none of this. Offices. Want eight offices? <laughs> okay small gates no stores okay we've got stores we've got cafes conference rooms no right i think i've got everything that i want right that i'll be happy with wait is all this now oh just put it down to zero is it just easier to do that offices eight small gates zero um, you did not assign a negotiated facilities in time. That's the easy jet one. Um, right, okay. So I can't turn it all off in reality. Conference rooms, zero. Cafes, one. Okay, we've got them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is... Even more confusing than I originally thought. So. Okay, send offer. Will they get back to us? They've ex United Airlines have accepted our offer. Nice. So then, we can get all these into place. So I assume on the grant side of it, Wait, what have I not got in now? Missing one store, one cafe. I have one store, one cafe. Missing eight offices. 
Oh, you got to assign them. My bad. What, do they want them cafes for themselves? Is that what it is? Interesting. Assign. Assign. So this will be quite easy to get the uh, the full shebang. The full... Ten offices in, in reality. So what's the issue now? It requires being secured by one or more reception zones. Why do they have all these needs? So reception area. Where's that? Can I am I just blind to looking for the reception? Visitors reception minimum free by free. Hmm. Right, construction. We're going to go for foundation. And I'm going to go for the whole hug there. All the way down to here. Hoping we can get this now done in time. How dare they want more? Who do they think they are right now? Requires to be secured by, uh, secured by one reception area. Fine, I get it. I understand what they're asking for. I understand it. So I'm going to build a new area altogether. So just wait for him to finish up on all of this. I'm going to dismantle the majority of all of this. There we go. We're waiting for it to here to be finalized. Such a pain, aren't they? Such a pain at the booty! Right, pause. So then, if I go to the do, 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 clone tool inside of it, if I dropped them there, then dropped these here, that is then a free by free gap in between. Which means for the zoning, I can do a visitor reception the whole length of this. Right. Okay, we'll get to it all. Oh, to be honest with you, I can build a separate area altogether, but I'm trying to incorporate all this right now. Is what I'm trying to do. So fast forward and see if I can get this done. Who would have thought the huge pain? I'll get this in and eventually I'll create a proper area for them. And maybe outside of the airport. But I understand what they're saying that there's no access. I can change one of the uh, the escalators to going in this direction. So that is obviously not the end of the world. If I uh, switch directions on that one, at least they can walk up here. But then they've got to navigate these security gates. So what I could do on that front is them security gates I could da, 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 place them further up here right to there instead so just give them a hot minute if I get the door in now uh, door there we go meaning I can then Dismantle you, dismantle you, and just pause again. So it requires a reception desk, which is quite large. Right, I'm going to have to drop it there for now. Requires access to the areas. i got to wait for them to be dismantled, I assume. Do you now have access? Oh, it needs a reception desk. It does. So even though this is like a really, really weak version, I'm just getting what needs to be done. So I have six there. If I literally clone the whole thing down here, I then have multiple. So offices, and then I move them over there. Then I've, I'll have 12 in total, which is over the 10 to start accepting early morning flights. So if I just unassign... Uh, a bunch of these. 
So a sign. A sign. Right, what do they need now that they're crying for? Sector cannot be vacated. Oh, is it because of these staff doors? Right. Door. Let's go for generic doors. See? We got there in the end. It was a pain, but we figured it out. But I understand now. I didn't know that this was a thing before today. So eventually we'll, we'll set up a proper designated zone for all the airlines to have their own versions of this. So dismantle, dismantle, dismantle. Let's go pause a minute. Now actually fast forward because obviously I've got to get rid of them doors. Try and get this all done before they all start crying at me. So I got to uh, get a new security person. Obviously, I, I assume for that reception area. A sign, a sign, a sign. Pause. That is all done for that area, but I need two more. So construction-wise, we're now going to completely clone this whole area here. Like I said, eventually I'll eventually have a dedicated area for all of this. But I'm just trying to get what I can get done. Which is going to require one more security person. So I'll get them hired now before I forget. Wait for them to do what they've got to do. And then we're in the money. So we just played the waiting game right now. Oh, we got to do. We got to zone it all. Right, away from to build everything. Come on, boys, get that building work done. Right, pause. Uh, so, visit a reception. Uh, offices. So the last two, well, the last four I need. I need two more really to make the ten. So sign that, and then they're done, right? Are they happy? What's now missing? Is there something else missing? No, I've got everything. Are they start complaining then? Yes, they have. Yes. Which now is going to be interesting. United Airlines store. So are these no longer my stores? How does this work? How many stores can we have in cafes? Flight management, then. Obviously, we'll try and do... Right, okay, select the rep. Um, unassigned, assign. Does that mean we can then negotiate? We must have at least eight flights. So who is the other one? It's easy, Jet. I think I might have screwed up. Can we negotiate again this time around? Yes, we can. So, okay, so let's go for large planes. Let's go for the afternoon. Let's call them up. Yo, EasyJet, talk to me. So, cafes and stores, zero. Well, let's start from the top. None of this malarkey. Once offices, I'll give them, you know, I'll give them four. Then we Gucci. So, none of that. One conference room, zero. Um, I can't do this zero, can I? Non-negotiable. Do I have to give him a store? Oh, no, 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 sorry. I don't have to. It's because they were selected up here. Where are they? Once. Well, it wants. Um... Okay, send offer. Wait for them to get back. We need to negotiate on a current deal. So they want... Now they want five offices? And they want a calf? Alright, next round of, of negotiations. No, four offices. That's all I can offer you. <laughs> no cafes. But what I will give you in return is a little bit more share on the cafe and the store. Minimum flight per load will do 20. And 
breach, we'll give him a hundred thousand. Send offer. Right. Come back with something good. We need to negotiate again. Right. Next round. So no to that. No to you. Well, zero there. I'll give you a bit more there. Okay, they don't want a minimum flight load. Um, how much an airplane is airplane's offer? Your offer? Oh, I'm sending this negotiation. They've accepted our current deal. So, accepted a deal, which means then... Okay, we'll schedule the flights first. Bam, bam, bam. And then can I... Are we in pause mode? Is that what the issue is? Why can I not give them the offices? What seems to be the issue? Don't tell me they don't want anything right now. Conference rooms. Oh, zero offices. <laughs> I want to cry. Right, i got to get the Ryanair done then, don't I? Uh, warning, this airline's fuel... Oh, am I out of fuel? Can I, like, continually order fuel? I have current reserves. 1%. So, set up recurring. Oh, we can put the, uh, the, the fuel price above. Uh, recurring... I'll buy some fuel now anyway. Okay. Right, so what was Ryanair's issue? We've negotiating. I must have at least eight flights. So Ryanair we have are they okay, one in the morning. One two Do we only have two? There's no other flights. That I can grab. British Airways. How many of them have we got? Let me find British Airways. Because we could get some of them if they've got enough planes. Yes. But they're not the right type of planes. Oh, easy jet. Why didn't you just make... Why don't you just have... It's my fault. I should have checked how many offices they was willing to take. So United Airlines or easy jet. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five, six. So okay, I could still get it. I just need um, you know, easy jet. You know, it's easy jet or United Airlines. Ah, uh, so I take on that grant. We are uh, what a pain. What a pain, boys. Right, we'll see how it goes. I'm still learning the art of negotiations. Get rid of all of them. Little notifications. Let the money flow in, boys. Let the money flow in. Price of fuel is going down. Oh, I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed. We got so close to just having flights all all year round. Right, filter for these. Damn it, easy jet. Can I renegotiate with them? Um, I'm calling you again, easy jet. I'm calling you again. So let's start from the top. I want you to have two offices. That's all I want. Just take two offices off me and we'll call it a day. We'll call it a day on two offices. Yay! Did they accept? Yes, they did. Oh, wrong button. Grant complete. 
Which then means I am in the clear. We're doing the early morning flights, right? We've unlocked it. Am I right in saying that? Yes. Boys, let's go. Let's go. But obviously, we haven't got any early morning flights, have we? Uh, nobody has anything for us. Nothing at all. So we'd have to wait until that's all reschedulable. <laughs> that made any sense whatsoever. Right, this is good. This is very good. The only downside is... I need more money. And the deals that we've done with the other airlines means that we don't really make as much money. But let's try and get some of the other airlines on the go anyway. So, uh, early, can I filter by this? I don't know if I can, can I? Uh, Lufthansa, where's your large at? Is it really only these that do large? Right, okay, hold on. One of each. So, in the afternoon... In the morning, is jet in the evening. More planes coming in. So United Airlines. We've got one in the evening I can take. Two in the afternoon. Move this over here. Or I can accept all these in the morning. Yes, boys. United Airlines coming in hot and heavy right now. Right, we're gonna. Since the last negotiation took place, we have found the deal is no longer suitable. We need to negotiate. Okay. Right, pause. So, what are they wanting this time around then? So, none of this. Don't even want any stores. The one in the conference room will get rid of you. Uh, they can have a little bit, a bit of a share. Why not? Go for it. Do you know what? That's pretty good. We'll send that deal. They've accepted it. Which means we get our stores back. Let's got to sort the rest of this scheduling out right now. There we go. Lots more aircraft incoming. Like a lot more aircraft incoming. So, looking swiggity swag for us right now, boys. Fuel tanks looking good, I believe. We got a recurring order on the go. Ah, <sighs> yeah. It's happening. It's happening for us now, boys. We're getting so freaking automated. But it's quite scary because I feel like a lot of this stuff is now out of my control. It's a weird one, isn't it? Now, any planes delayed or looking like they're going to be delayed? I don't think so. Do we need more fuel vehicles? Maybe. Who knows? Who knows at this point? But these are going to be making some more money right now. The amount of visitors now tearing through. Security it looks like it's able to kind of uphold it. I don't know where we build another, a whole another layer. Of, um, do you know what I'm going to? I'm going to build the next layer. So clone all of these to here or there. It would be there, wouldn't it? Which is a lot of money. Always going to have to hire so much more staff. <clears throat> but it's going to be able to kind of um, filter through so many more passengers. So wait for all this to get done. So security right now, oh my goodness, we need 24 more people. Bam, there we go. Uh, in, in terms of zoning, I think I'm going to do for the security, just drag it over to there. So, because I'm noticing some of them are walking back, so I'm hoping they can just run through and just skedaddle straight away. Uh, lots of people walking through there, so this is where we are going to start, well, start thinking about trying to get the connection on the upstairs all done. Because there's just so many people trying to get through. Security is massive right now, isn't it? Right. So, any morning flights? Yeah. Not really. 
Not really, boys. So we gotta start thinking about the next expansions then. So there's no point buying any new land at the minute. We got no delays on the go, which is looking good. Oh, my goodness me, 1.7 million. Have we just spent money on fueling? Ha ha ha! You're hilarious! You're hilarious right now. Right, ten percent. They've just spent my all my so much cash on buying 1.6 million liters. I didn't realize it it completely fills the tank up. But I suppose I ain't gonna spend any more for quite a long time right now. It's just that's a lot of money to go into debt. <laughs> right, research time. Um, do I try and lower my property tax? Of course I do, mate. It's queued apparently. What am I waiting for? Am I waiting for something? Maybe. Maintenance and actually configure maintenance options. One way paths. One way taxiways. Uh, allows you to build intersecting runways. Gate control. Technology. And it, okay, it's advanced ticketing. Ooh. Baggage boosters increase sorting through your hubs. Operations 2. Allows management of bus. Ooh, that would be a good one as well. I've accepted it to be queued, but I'm not sure what's going up in there. Standby gates. Yeah, a lot going on. A lot going on. But a lot of money just disappeared at my boy's bank account. Right, next day. Yes, now we've got early morning aircraft flights. So, go back to the large. I'll take it none of them are large then, right? Easy jet. Small. I mean, it's a start, right? It is a start, so... Um, right, if I accept the couple. I've accepted three to see how we would do on the small side of it. Um, negotiate. Hold on. So they're wanting stuffs. Cafes. Conference rooms. I'm thinking about, do you know what? Not renewing it. I'll, I'll renew it one more time. You know what? Yeah, I'm going to terminate it. Forget that. Alright, try and stagger these and get free then. Another set of free, basically. So, easy jet. Alright, accept all these early morning flights. And then, bam. So, do any small airplanes so it won't be too mental. You would hope so, anyway. Uh, lefance has got one. Small, anyway. Estonia Air. Hello. Welcome to the game. New aircraft landing. There we go. So try and get the rest of these now all lined up. It's a big jump to ask, isn't it? All of a sudden to start accepting all these flights. Singapore Air. Wow, so many aircrafts. So this will start building me a reputation with the other airlines if I slowly start accepting some of their airplanes. All right, you go there. You're there. And then you're there. So I can only accept two more now after this point. Southwest Airlines. Bam, bam. And then I think... No, I don't have a full schedule. I've got some space. I've got two in the afternoon. Uh, Tui. What you got for me? Small and a small. I'll accept the smalls. I'm happy with that. I have now what I would consider a complete and utter full schedule. So the next following day is going to be mental. And we should make so much cash back. To which we're going to need to. Just solely down for the fact of 
we'll terminate it. I haven't lost the flights, have I? Oh, snap. We have. Oh, no. We've lost those ones that were negotiated. Southwest Airlines. How much space have we got? Uh, free. Oh, I should have just done large. Okay, right. I want to replace them with large ones. That's what I want to do anyway. But it's all looking good then. So, yeah. We've we've spent all that money, obviously, in buying all that fuel. But it's an expense I won't have again in terms of that size. We'll only now rebuy what we've spent. And making 10% profit, I assume... On all the fuel. That's what I'm assuming anyway. I suppose you just never know. Um, everything looking good then. We're making some serious cash. It's slowly coming back into our pockets. But most importantly, we now have a full schedule of early morning flights. That is very important for us. Very important. I think what we need to do then is slowly save up to buy more parcels of land. So I can then get additional runways the more runways i have the more ease it will then be on all these planes trying to land at once and i got so out of the car parking situation too yeah more passengers bring more problems but we'll try and keep on top of it we'll ultimately try and keep on top of it we're doing a little bit of research in here and there Operations is all up and running right now, so we can kind of handle like a bunch of operations, like uh, micromanagement, all that kind of jazz. Um, so I think we should slowly be getting there then. We've got food lined up in all these counters, looking pretty full because we've got, well, two chefs now working on it. So not bad, not bad. We've got the extended baggage line. We've got... The three additional gates now all hooked up. We've got the fuel system all hooked up right now, and it's working beautifully. We have some offices, which were originally set up for the airlines, but now those deals have been negotiated and disappeared, but that's okay. I'm not too worried about that. We have set up a large hangars for more baggage and the fuel in trucks. I've now got to redo all my airline interests, but I don't think I'm going to accept any more deals. Just sold it down to the fact that I want to build my interest all back up. Trying to build my revenue all back up again as well. And then the continued expansions happen. So in terms of the next set of grants we're going to be taking a look at, then all these are done. Airline services completed. Passenger experience then. The next one could be building five stores. Build oh see five stores that makes you want to then kind of um, separate those into multiple ones. It actually would be me completing the upstairs section. Um, build two first class lounges. Get the Pax Environmental Sex to eighty percent. That's this one. We're already at ninety percent, so that could be easy ish. Who knows? I don't know. I don't know. Investments wise, pay off any loans. Wait for seven days. Get that done. All I've got to do is technically now wait for seven days. That will keep me going. And um, have an airport at least 15 days old. Pay off any loans. Wait 12 days. Look at the amount of money you get back in return for this stuff. I should be doing these, shouldn't I? These little investments. I think I should. So we'll just wait off and, until all of this has been paid. That will be the name of the game at this point. So with more planes are landing, um, flight was cancelled. What does that mean? It was cancelled. Is that because I need more room on the runways? Is that what it could be? I mean, I could build a taxiway just there. I don't know how much handy that would be if they need the space. But we'll find out. Again, I'm still learning on this whole runway stuff right now. Still kind of kind of learning. But 1.4 million in the hole we are right now. I don't want to get a loan, because obviously I'm doing those investments, and there'll be ways that I can repay it back with the bonus money we kind of get on top. 
So now is the next day. We should officially have our first sets of flights coming in, which they are. Okay, they can use that. So we do have two entrances and exits right now, which could potentially be utilized. I don't know how handy that would be. Failure to reserve runway. Okay, that's an issue with not enough um, space on the runway, which can go negatively against us. It's why we need a second runway, Zodiac. Down to 1.1 million right now. So, like I said, the money's slowly coming in. But the difference is right now, we can make money every single hour of the day. Before, we weren't accepting those early morning flights, which we had a kind of big period where nothing happened. Now something's happening, guys. And now we are officially rocking and a rolling. So we'll try and pay off the debts for next episode. We'll try and look at expanding and uh, buying some more runways. Getting all that up and running. What I think I might do, save the, the, the hassle. Build a runway across here for now. And have this side, these, these three here, connected to that runway. Um... I mean, eventually, we have nice to have this whole section here connected to one runway, and then when we have the gates on this side, that connected to another runway as well. Which would mean then having the runways going sideways down there. I don't know how that would work out. But, yeah. We'll see. I mean, we've got all the planes here right now, so, I mean, this is not... This hasn't seemed to be an issue at this point. Is anybody running late? Everyone's running on time. So there's not really much of an issue there. Is it just me being a bit picky? Is that what it is? Oh, I don't know. I don't know at this moment in time. It's a weird one. But what I do know is, guys, we are going to end it for here. I hope you did enjoy this episode. If you did, smash that like button down below. And until next time, guys, I'll see you all soon. So good. <laughs>